Oh, well, I've just had a, a few words with Ben outside the room, and um, he's in a lovely, relaxed state at the moment. Oh, that's good. So we're just going to um, demonstrate a, a couple of inductions. Okay. Uh, in other words, ways to put people into um, into trance very, very quickly. All right. Well, um, I'll, let, I'll, I'll let you get into that now, if you would like. Okay, cool. Um, first thing I'd like to do is something called the three handshake induction, and right. it basically involves shaking Ben's hand three times. Now, the first time I shake your hand, Ben, um, you're going to feel that heaviness in your eyelids, and they're really going to want to close down. Like you've been watching a movie late at night, um, but I don't want you to let them close. Okay. Second time I shake your hand, it's going to be an impulse to close your eyes, but again, I, I want you to fight it. Don't do it until the third time I shake your hand. And what will happen then is an instant wave of relaxation will hit you from the top of your head all the way down to the tips of your toes. And you'll be able to stay in your seat, you'll still be seated there, but every, every muscle that's not involved in, in um, keeping you on that chair will just instantly relax and you'll fall down ten times more relaxed than you are now. Okay? So the first handshake. So the second handshake, you're going to feel a real urge to close your eyes, but I'm going to fight it. Okay, cool. Okay, okay fight. No, fight it, then fight. Okay, now the third handshake, it's going to hit you instantly, and you'll be instantly relaxed. Okay. Sleep. Wow. That's pretty amazing. So Ben is completely relaxed. If you see, we can just lift his arm up, and it just drops it right down. straight back down. And in fact, then when it hits your lap, just sends you, send you ten times deeper, yeah. ten times deeper into yeah. this state that we call hypnosis. Entirely out of that. Right? That's right. Ben's, Ben's good because he's got um, a, a very good ability to concentrate and focus. So right. that's um, that's why we're able to do this okay. so successfully. And um, so, what are you going to do with Ben right now? What's the what's the next stage in the process? Now he's sort of just he looks like he's asleep. Obviously, it's not sleep though. It's just a, it's actually. A, amplified um, focus, amplified concentration. Right. So what's happening here is that he's focused on a single idea. In fact, we um, used to call hypnosis monoideism because that's what it is. It's the focus on a single, One idea. single idea. Right. And in fact, the more intelligent people are, the more able they are to enter into hypnosis. I've, I've gone to a very deep state. I'm sure you will. I'm sure you will, Spanky. We'll try it with you. Well, okay, <laughs> maybe. We'll see. Okay, so what's the... Are you, you going to get him to do... Funny things is that the is that the next step? What happens now? Um, in a moment, Ben, when I when I get you to open your eyes, every single thing that Spanky says you're going to find hilarious, absolutely hysterical. He's the funniest man you've ever come across, and even very simple things that he says are just going to make you laugh hysterically more than you've ever laughed before. So um, if you just open your eyes for me, Ben. Go well, How you feeling? Good. How's it? How's it? Good. Talk to him, Spanky. Hey, Ben. How you going? You good. You good? Yeah. Pretty good. Uh, yeah, chuckling a wee bit there. Yeah. So, the, any, any, you're thinking something a bit funny there? Huh? No, nothing funny. <laughs> huh? Hey, um, oh man, what do you think of this thing that's gone down in Burma, eh? What the, like, what is that? Like 130,000 people died. That's terrible, eh? Yeah. But the more things oh, he says, the funnier you find it, Ben. The more things he says, the funnier you find it. Isn't it? I mean, oh. And what about that Chinese earthquake? How many how many people died there? What was that twenty thousand people or something? <laughs> Eight. Uh, that's terrible. Oh, oh yeah, it's fucked. That's <laughs> <laughs> oh, and what are we going to do about this AIDS epidemic in Africa? Have you got any suggestions there? Uh, no. None at all. No. None that you can think of. No. What do you think of apples? <laughs> <laughs> Moldy old piece of cheese. You like cheese? Yeah. 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 You ever had a grandparent die? Uh, yeah. Well, that was pretty sad. Yeah. Yeah, it was pretty sad though, wasn't it? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> pretty sad. Oh dear me. Nostrils. <laughs> what? What? Ar armpits? Yeah. You feel okay about armpits? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Sure, sure. Yeah, 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 yeah. We'll go down. That makes ben. a lot of sense. <laughs> ben, ben, look at me and just sleep. Relax deeper and deeper. That's great. He's oh. more and more relaxed. You're doing really well, really, really well here. Okay, in a moment, every time um, Spanky says the word blue, you're just going to feel like you've been bitten by a mosquito somewhere on your body. Okay, a welt won't appear, but you'll actually feel the sensation that you've been bitten by a mosquito somewhere on your body above the waist, 
and um, you'll feel the urge to actually scratch that. Every time he says the word blue, you'll really feel that that mosquito has bitten you. Okay, then you say from your eyes now. Hey, Ben. Hi. It's been beautiful weather today, eh? It is. Beautiful blue sky. Hey, just so blue outside. It is. It's, we, um... Are you a bit scratchy there? You right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, I know, it's just so blue. I mean, it's interesting to see such a blue, blue, blue sky <laughs> um, on a winter's day. Oh, it's bloody cold, though. Is it? Is there a mosquito? Are you all right? Okay. Yeah, I, yeah fine. I, I think we might have fleas or something at home. Yeah, right, I see. I see. I understand. Yeah, but what do you think? I mean, that's a, what, how would you describe that shade of blue? What kind of blue would it be? What would you say? Um, the sky. Yeah, what, what, what shade? How would you say that? Would the aqua the blue? Sky blue. Sky blue. Yeah, it's very blue, isn't it? Yeah. You alright? Okay, bent and slick. Deeper, <laughs> even deeper than before. That's great. Well done. See how the, the subconscious will actually justify why he's scratching an issue? Like he oh, comes up with the explanation of just fleeing the home. Are you at home, Margaret? If you, if you think about it, that's what we do all the time. We actually justify things to ourselves when we don't have an explanation wow. to it. That's all that's happening there. That's Ben's imagination and the creative part of his mind just really coming into play. So, when, so. when he scratches, he would, would he give any satisfaction from that or not? Um, you should ask him. Yeah. <laughs>